Ahoy Scallywags and welcome to a new tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up Capcom Play Systems 2, aka CPS2, on LaunchBox. This is the second part to my three-part tutorial on Capcom Play Systems. Let's get started with downloading RetroArch. The link is provided below. RetroArch is a great program for running multiple emulators. After downloading, run the install. Install a location on your computer. After the install is complete, open RetroArch and select Load Core. Download Core. Select Arcade MAME 2003. You will see it download below. Back up to the main menu. Let's set up our controls. Under Settings, select Input. Click Port 1 Controls and map your keys to the, your controller. I'm going to use an Xbox controller for this tutorial, but you can map the controller to any input you like. Now let's set up CPS2 on LaunchBox. Open up LaunchBox and go to Settings, Tools, Import, ROM Files. Next, Add Files. Navigate to your ROMs folder, select all the ROMs and click Open. Next, for platform type, type CPS2. Under Scrape Add, select Arcade and then Next. For Choose Emulator, click on Add. Under Emulator Name, type CPS2. For Emulator Application Path, click Browse and navigate to your RetroArch Execute file and click Open. For Associated Platforms, type CPS2. Type the provided line for the default command line parameters. Check the box for the default emulator and then click OK. Next, select Use Files in their current location and then Next. 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 Check the box for a force using main metadata and then click Next. Next. And then Finish. Now you're ready to play Capcom Play System 2 games on LaunchBox. I would highly recommend all the Capcom Play System games for your arcade. If you like this video, gouge out the like button, dismember the subscribe button, and electrocute the bell for future video notifications. Until next time, buckos, this is the Arcade Pirate sailing out.